okay uh, hi guys in this experiment we're gonna see about open circuit test on a single phase transformer so uh, we are going to conduct a uh, two tests one for a uh, open circuit test and other for a uh, short circuit test so the objective of this experiment is to predetermine the efficiency at different load at UPF and uh, 0 0.8 power factor lagging and to predetermine the full load regulation at different power factor and finally to draw curve between output and uh, efficiency and power factor versus regulation so the apparatus required will be a single phase transformer a meter voltmeter watt meter and auto transformer okay before we move to the procedure first uh, precautions is that uh, the fuse is selected such that 120 percent of its uh, rated current the dpst switch is uh, kept open while making circuit connections at the time of starting and at the end of the experiment the auto transformer should be kept at the minimum position okay the procedure for open circuit test is that first the dpst switch is closed and the auto transformer is adjusted to get the rated voltage the open circuit readings are taken and the uh, open circuit readings like voltmeter ammeter and uh, wattmeter readings are uh, taken down in a tablet column for uh, open circuit test uh, the tabulated value will be uh, voltmeter reading uh, 115 volt ammeter reading will be 0 0.5 and wattmeter reading will be 32 and the core loss will be 32 for uh, this type of wattmeter the multiplying factor uh, you should find in the wattmeter itself it will be uh, noted down in the below of the wattmeter or uh, it should be uh, or in the back side okay uh, for a short circuit test this is the circuit diagram uh, there are few changes in the circuit like you can see uh, in a open circuit test the primary side will be a uh, uh, 50 percent and the secondary percent will be a 0 to 100 percent but in a short circuit test the primary side will be 100 percent and secondary side will be 50 percent and then uh, you can see the watt meter readings will be different uh, in in open circuit test uh, i have taken lpf type of watt meter and 300 volt to volt by uh, 2.5 ampere but in a short circuit test i have taken a 300 volt per 5 ampere type watt meter the ammeter will be uh, before the uh, watt meter The procedure for a uh, uh, open circuit test on a single phase transformer for short circuit is that the DPST switch is closed and the auto transformer is adjusted to get the rated current and then the watt meter, ammeter and watt meter values are taken down. For short circuit test, I have noted down in the tableau column the reading. So the volt meter reading will be uh, 13 0.79 and the ammeter reading will be 4.3 watt meter reading will be 53 so the full load copper loss will be 53 okay uh, before moving to the uh, regulation for a uh, uh, lagging and le uh, leading power factor i want to show you the formula used in this uh, used uh, with this tabulation so R0 is equal to V0 by I0 cos phi0. So you can see the values here. I have written down. So in cos phi is equal to W0 by V0 I0. So the W0 will be um, open circuit watt meter reading. And V0 will be uh, open circuit uh, voltage. 
and I naught will be the open circuit current. Okay, and then x naught is equal to v naught by uh, i naught sine phi naught. It will be uh, one fifteen by zero point three four, and uh, r naught one will be w s c by i square s c. Um, w s c s c means uh, short circuit current. Short circuit, sorry. Short circuit uh, watt meter value and the short circuit current value. And z naught one is equal to v s c by i s c. Uh, x naught one is equal to root of Z not one square minus R not one square, and finally uh, the percentage efficiency uh, will be x into V A rated x power factor by x into V A rated uh, x power factor plus x square total loss into hundred. Using this tabulated values. Uh, we will find the predetermination of a percentage regulation of single phase transformer and predetermine predetermination of percentage efficiency of a single phase transformer for a constant load or a variable or power factor sorry a constant power factor or a variable uh, power factor so uh, here it will be a constant load ratio you can see here and the power factor cos phi and the percentage regulation uh, one, one is for a leading power factor and other is for lagging power factor so the formula okay uh, this formula is for a, a leading and lagging uh, power factor you can see the formula here so with this formula uh, I have noted down for a leading power factor and lagging power factor for the corresponding um, cos phi value and for a constant power factor with variable load ratio uh, this is for a constant uh, load ratio for variable power factor uh, and noted down for a for the constant load ratio that is 0, 0 0.25, 0 0.5, 0 0.75 and finally 1 so using this formula Using this formula, uh, I have calculated and uh, find the values. So, and finally, we have to draw a graph. So, the model graph will be okay, this one for a performance curve and a regulation curve. For performance for a uh, regulation curve, mm, I have taken in uh, x1 dash leading power factor and uh, in x lagging power factor, and the graph will look like this. And in y axis, I have taken regulation. So the another graph graph will be a performance curve. So in uh, x axis, in y axis, I have taken percentage efficiency. And in a y axis, okay, uh, y axis I have taken a watt meter reading. So the graph will be look like this. Thanks for watching this video.